New at 10, we're hearing from some Limestone County residents after one of two escaped inmates was caught near their homes. Brian Vincent was found in the woods off of Compton Road, north of Alabama 251. He walked away from his work detail at Vulcan Plastics early this morning. Limestone County deputies are still looking for this man, Jeremy Tucker. Thanks for joining us tonight. I'm Will Robinson Smith. Way 31 Scotty K joins us live from the sheriff's office in Limestone County with how that search is going and what neighbors have to say about it. Scotty. Will, deputies with the Limestone County Sheriff's Office assisted Athens police after they got a call about a man looking for a ride. That man was escaped inmate Brian Vincent. After they got some help from some K-9 officers, Vincent was taken into custody quickly, but some folks are still worried about the other inmate who's still on the run. We jumped up. When it came and locked our doors, the front and the back. Helinda Lassie lives right across the street from where deputies found Brian Vincent, one of the two inmates who walked away from their work detail at Vulcan Plastics early Sunday morning. When she saw a large police presence in her neighborhood, it scared us to death. Deputies say the inmates were making a delivery near the plastic fabrication company when they abandoned a piece of equipment and took off. It's kind of nerve wracking because it's a lot of us single women that are out here with kids. Yeah. Kids are constantly running around playing. This is the third time an inmate has escaped from the work release program in Limestone County in less than five months. Some folks say they'd like to see an increase in security or surveillance at the companies where inmates work. Somebody should be there watching them 24-7. Others say they aren't a fan of the program at all. I feel like they need to stop <laughs> having yeah. inmates go to the companies and just keep them in the jail. While Vincent is now back behind bars, neighbors say they'll be extra cautious until Tucker is found. We're out here at night. Sometimes we might have to go to the mailbox, yeah. the washer and dryer, or may just during, need to come outside and throw some away. So yeah. that's definitely going to make me keep my eyes open, yeah. you know, check my surroundings. We'll keep our eye out, keep the doors locked. Again, the Limestone County Sheriff's Office is still looking for Tucker and following all leads. They don't believe he's a danger to the public, but they ask that if you see him, don't approach him. Instead, you should call the Limestone County Sheriff's Office. Reporting live in Limestone County, Scotty K, Way 31 News.